Singhi, what a pleasant surprise. Wait till you see the real one. Huh? Kya kar raha hai? I'm taking portraits of my bikes on the Vivo X70 Pro. Hmm. You know what? Over the next two days, you can take lots of pictures with our two companions. They are very adventurous, so all you need to do is pack your sense of adventure and let's go. Right now, would you be more interested if I said there were Bollywood personalities involved? Bollywood? Let me introduce you to our Bollywood action superstars. Akshay Kumar and Tiger Shroff. What? But wait. You've been spending too much time with Chuvi, no? Maybe a little bit. But motorcycles, now these two are new age adventure bikes which I've been dying to get together for a comparison test. The Ducati Multistrada V4 is like Akshay Kumar. You know, tried, tested, does its own stunts and is just getting better with age. And on the other hand, you have Tiger Shroff, the young upstart, the new action Jackson, trying to make his name as the action star. Congratulations! You have officially lost it. In that way, can you spot our two new age cinematographers? There's nobody here. Well, there is your Vivo X70 Pro and this Vivo X70 Pro Plus. With the 48 megapixel camera, we can shoot Bollywood like films on this journey. The Multistrada is one of the superstars of the adventure touring world. New Avtar, it ditches the desmodromic valve system to make the bike smoother and cooler as the cylinder deactivation for stop-start conditions and the split radiators and ducts funnel air away too. The Pan America is Harley's first adventure tourer, but it gets a lot, right? It is spacious, would be comfy even for Big B and you would need his long legs though because it feels even taller than the Ducati. Charlie Davidson gave this a lower seat height in the form of their adaptive ride module as standard. I don't think I've ever said this before, but the Ducati doesn't feel hot in the city, man. Unfortunately, I can't say that for the Pan Am. The rear cylinder is sitting right below me and the headers as well, very close to my legs. The right hand side is definitely getting cooked. I guess these bikes, finally you want to be out on the open road. Yeah. yeah? Let's carry on. For Gran Turismo has multiplied the Multistrada formula. There's more performance, more technology and more ability, all of which makes it more of a Kiladi. The new engine packs more cylinders, four of them, and there's more power, 170. So it blitzes open stretches and in true Ducati fashion this Multi S has lots of tech like radar based aids. The Harley can't relax because it is out to make a mark with an all new engine. Yes, as you would expect of an Harley, it has only two cylinders which packs more than the Ducati. More displacement and more torque, that too at lower revs. But it isn't old school. There are ride modes and electronic suspension on offer here. You know, it's surprising. Harley Davidson's made a certain kind of motorcycle, a certain kind of engine, but this, the Revolution Max, I think it suits its personality so very well. I, it's not the most refined engine in the world, but that one word that I think sticks to it very well is drama. Lots of it. I could see that it's got a lot of grunt the way you were using it, but it feels like it's kind of angry, right? Yeah. <laughs> what about the multi? Yeah, the multi, that's an interesting change that's happened here with this generation because it's got more cylinders, more power, but torque has actually gone down. I think it's better for it because now it just behaves in a more mature manner. 
I would I wouldn't call it serene but it is calmer at times when you want to just soak in the sights I mean at no point should you make a mistake and think that this is slow or lazy This new design for the fairing is the other thing that has hit home because you sit behind it and you don't feel the wind blast you don't hear anything it's just so nice and calm there as well and it's so easy to adjust then i tried doing that on 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 the pan am it's a, it's a bit of a wrestle isn't it it is a bit of a wrestle for sure i was asking you to lead because i've got adaptive cruise control there's blind spot detection so i know it's a lot of technology that people don't necessarily want on their motorcycles but it just does feel a little bit more helpful and you get used to it pretty quickly yeah before you claim all the accolades where are we heading next i know road down here which is really good and we can have a lot of fun over there with these bikes you really you mean corners right did i say that elevator going up up another level had to cut the roof off before i hit the pedal all these goals in my mouth caught a heavy metal yeah i'm what they want give them what they want i give them The Multi Strada is honed for agility. Its wheelbase is shorter, the bars are wider, and the counter-rotating crank sharpens its manners further. And all of it sits in a monocoque chassis. The result is an experience that would make Mr. Kumar's best action sequence seem a bit slow and lazy. Mr. Kumar would have thought that he would just fly into the distance, but Tiger Shroff is fierce. Ali uses the engine as a stressed member to cut back on weight. I got thrills, I got thrills. That was fun. <laughs> Mr. New Kid on the block. Please do tell what that was like. I'm pleasantly surprised. Apart from the weight of the motorcycle which steering it becomes a little difficult but it's not as bad. as you would expect from a 250 kilo plus motorcycle it still handles really well it's got a long wheelbase it's a big bulky motorcycle yeah, right no but that really adds to how stable the motorcycle is even in the corners and even on the highway but the one thing that i felt was a little amiss is going to be the suspension i know it's electronic suspension i know harley's made an attempt at electronic suspension you compare it to what that has that's got years of experience This feels more like a first gen attempt. I think the one thing that really hits home with the Multi V4 now is just how everything works together. The suspension really just changes the attitude of the motorcycle. It's feeling lighter to steer. We're in a sport mode and then you can see all that anger, all that redness that you expect from a Ducati just pouring out. Now, ladies and gentlemen, You've made me go around corners, but we are here for some adventure, right? Do you want to do some real adventure? If you insist. Yeah. And do you want to get mm. some friends along? Uh, oh yeah, our cinematographers. That's got gimbal stabilization. It'll be superb. These big, heavy, and powerful motorcycles are happier on fast, rough roads than slow technical trails. To test them, we chose something in between. The Pan America with 175 mm of ground clearance and a longer wheelbase is a bit outgunned. But Mr. Shroff has a few tricks, like a solid bash plate, straight pull spoke rims and suspension that has hard and soft settings. Incredibly, the Multi Strada's new V4 engine is lighter and more compact than the L twin before it. It has also allowed the wheelbase to shrink. But with its alloy wheels, you don't want to go hunting for rocky trails. Coming out of off-road sections, unscathed, and the motorcycle safe is hugely satisfying. Actually that also reminds me of the Pro Plus because its stabilization worked so well the videos really? that we've got yeah smooth How was Tiger in the wild the chassis is very communicative and when you pair it with 
the grunt of the engine of the Pan Am. I think it's a very good, very good fix. But oh yeah, there's the but. It is a heavy motorcycle to yeah. manage. Yeah, to manage especially at low speed when you're taking tight turns. You want the suspension even when you're going off road. You want it to soak up quite a bit, and it still feels a little not as compliant as you would want. To reduce weight, they've gotten plastics, and the quality of plastics could have been a whole lot better. Tiger Shroff's carrying a really heavy name. The brand's established, but the product will take a while to get better, and that's the panel. How was Akshay Kumar? Well, that was of course meant to be a joke, but it's incredible <laughs> how well it's fitting the multi strata because it is clearly getting better with age, and that holds true even off road because the new engine gives you. Power in a manner that is just more manageable. I'm not saying any of these bikes is a piece of cake to ride off. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think the Multi V4 has become a really well-rounded, even better, more accomplished, more sophisticated motorcycle. One that makes its higher price tag just feel like the premium for a premium motorcycle. But no conversation about top action stars mm. is complete without Salut. Salu, the GS, <laughs> the off-road king. But that's a story for another day. For now, let's take a look at what your cinematographers have captured today. And that's the only way. I try and make all of this money in the fast way. Yeah, you know what I mean. I try and make all of this money in the fast way. Yeah, you know what I mean. Your boots are also supposed to be waterproof. Why don't you test those out as well? Unfortunately, they aren't IP68 rated, but this phone is. <laughs>